Hi everyone, with Kelvin here. So let's discuss about weekly contest 155. Third question, smallest string with swaps. So we are given a string S, an array of pairs. In this, the string pairs where um, pair is A, B. Like, um, so it means like um, if we connect 0 and 3, um, 0 and 3 is in one group. And 0 and 2, if we connect it, um, 0 and 2 is one group. That um, means also 2 and 3 is in one group. And when we connect one and two, so one and two is also one group. One and three is also one group. So all of them is connected um, directly or indirectly. They are uh, one group. So we've been asked to swap any character that is in one group, um, so that um, it's a smallest lexicographical order of string um, we can make. So in this case, um, we have string of length four means from index 0 to 3 and from index 0 to 3 as we can imagine this is um, all in one group so in that case um, all of them can be swapped so we want the smallest um, one at the front so the smallest one will be become a b c d but take a look on the first example so we uh, merge the index 0 and 3 and uh, index 1 and 2 so index 1 and 2 we can swap it to become a c and index 0, 3, we can swap it to become B, D. So B, D, and A, C. So B, A, C, D is the smallest lexicographical order we can make. So how are we going to solve this question? So um, this kind of pair is a typical um, disjoint union set question. So you need to know um, how to perform a disjoint union set. Um, you probably can Google for it. So yeah. But um, here is the rough code. It's pretty easy to code. Like um, um, we join two group into one by by its parent, and when we try to find, so this find will perform a O one um, O n uh, at first uh, first access, and then um, after that um, it will become O one. Um, yeah, because we modify the parent to become its direct parent of um, its parent. So yeah. And here we initialize the group, so each of the um, index will have its own index for its parent unless it's got merged. And after that, we loop through the entire list to perform the union. So we merge uh, two group into one. And after we merge all the group, we can determine um, how many group are there. Like um, this integer represent the group number. So when we do a group, like um, let's say group one and group two being merged, we determine like. Um, parent of group 1 equals to group 2 parent something like that and then yeah we just make a queue basically I use a priority queue in that case um, so yeah when I put it to the group I try to find that index um, parent so that index what is the group itself by using the find function and then we add that character to those group and it will be automatically sorted by the priority queue so at the end um, we try to build the string which is the lowest um, lexicographical order we can get the smallest lexicographical order we can get so we loop through the entire string um, so of course we know the group by the index itself so we find the index i who is the parent and we do the poll on the priority queue so in that case we make sure like we always use the smallest character in the available in those group and then at the end we um, build the string from the string builder and we can get the answer so yeah that's it for this question thank you for watching see you on the next weekly contest